All right, 240 degrees and that 10 little thing, what does that mean? Well, remember when we were breaking up our number line, right? Um, we break up numbers, then to break up numbers, we also went into like fractions, right? You have one and then between one and then you went to two, but between one and two, we had one, one and a quarter, one and a half, one and three quarters. You can break them into eights, you know, one and seven eighths, three eighths. So there's ways on our number system to go between our integers. And when we look at numbers, there's also, when we look at numbers that are degrees, we have one degree, two degrees, three degrees, four degrees. Well, there's another way for us to break up between um, our measurements between our degrees, all right? And so what I have is if this is re uh, represented as 240 degrees and 10 minutes. Now, when thinking about how many degrees or how many minutes does it take to create a minute? Well, what we can write this of is 240 degrees plus uh, 240 degrees and that's uh, zero over 60 minutes, all right? So, sorry, I should probably write the plus, plus 60 minutes, meaning there's 60 minutes that are gonna make up one degree. Now in this problem, I don't have, I don't have zero minutes. I actually have 240 degrees plus 10 over 60 minutes. So there's 60 minutes, sorry, I should do this. Zero over 60 minutes equals 60 over 60 minutes equals one degree. So therefore, if you can look at this, what I have, I don't know why I wrote that, that's kind of incorrect. Um, so I have 240 degrees plus 10 over 60 minutes. So now to evaluate, find the exact value of this in the decimal approximation, I'm gonna say, because it's gonna be a repeating decimal, it's gonna be 240 plus 10 divided by 60 is going to give me one, um, point one sorry, 0.16, six, 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 I'll go on and repeat it. So 240 plus 0.1666 is going to be approximately 240.16666 on repeating. So when doing this, you just in your memory minutes, there's take 60 minutes to make one degree. So whatever a minute you take, put that over 60 and add it to your degrees. There you go, ladies and gentlemen. I hope that helped you out. Um, if not, let me know down below and I'll be able to uh, direct you further, all right? Thanks again for watching. Please subscribe, comment, whatever makes you happy. Thanks. Thanks.